Good morning, Ready Group. It is Kim from uh, Alberta, Canada, tuning in this morning. So I just wanted to give you a quick little virtual tour of the green, um, the cold storage room that we had built earlier on in the year, and uh, just to give you an update on whether or not it was working, and uh, it is. And so I'm really happy to say that right now it is um, minus 26, the wind chill probably about minus 37, and um, the cold room is currently sitting at four or five degrees, so it is perfect and it's withstanding the cold. Now I'm just gonna flip my camera around. So you can here. see it's just a little pony stub wall. It's only about four feet out of the ground. The rest of the about six or seven feet is um, backfilled in this uh, backfilled lot here. And so just walking around the side of the garage here to give you an idea of my cold room setup. And what we have going on here, so here's the side, so it's only about four feet, and this here, that um, little receptacle right here, that's the cold air intake, and um, that brings cold air in from outside. So, the cold room is built on the far side of the garage, which is a backfill, and so it's actually about six feet submerged into the earth here. So there's my cold room at the very back. It's a work in progress. So this here with the door is the cold room and then there's storage on top and then beside it to the right there is going to be a small bathroom and then three bay sink for washing up veggies and doing wine and stuff like that. And here is the cold storage room. So what we've done is it's got an exterior door that is insulated super tight seal at the bottom that you can see it drags and so the lights on so I'm showing you that receptacle from the outside there there it is coming down now I've actually got it shoved full of newspaper right now because it is minus 38 outside I don't want any more cold air coming in but take a look at my temperature gauge here it's sitting right at four degrees which is just perfect um, everything is looking good. The potatoes and the squashes and onions, everything is in mint condition. I just thought it was worthwhile to show you guys that what we had done with the cold storage room in our garage and that uh, it was definitely worth it and it's working really well and even in temperatures as cold as minus 38, it's still holding strong in its temperature and I just thought that maybe that would help any preppers out there looking for more storage space or how to incorporate their um, a cold storage room on in like a city setting. Um, yeah, that's everything. You guys have a great day.